The given equation relates the value of x and its corresponding value of p of x for the function p. What is the minimum value of the function p? So we're given actually a quadratic equation. By subtracting both sides by 57, we get p of x is equal to x squared minus 57. That's a quadratic equation. It will open upward and look something like this, and almost exactly like this, where the value would be here and open upward like this. And why did I put its vertex at x equals 0? Well, that's because, if we recall, x equals negative b over 2a which is the value of the x-coordinate of the vertex. And there is no b. There is no b value here, so our vertex x-coordinate would be 0. Now, what would our y-coordinate be? Well, recall that this value is our y-intercept. y because when p of x equals, or p of 0 equals 0 minus 57, meaning this would be our y-intercept, meaning this would be our y-value of the vertex and also our minimum value of the function. As we can see, our vertex is minimum value as it opens upwards. So, what is our minimum value of the function? It would be negative 57. Now, usually I say to put this into Desmos, but this question in particular was more easier to solve without going to Desmos because we could have easily witnessed that negative 57 was our minimum value as it is our y-coordinate of our vertex. If you figured it out yourself, drop I did it in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and follow classbox.ai for daily SAT shortcuts.